Wendy's uh, right by the Denver airport. We're really excited. We love to do staycations here in the Denver area when it's cold and it's the holidays. It's just, it's just really nice to go to these big hotels and relax and, you know, hang out at their indoor pools and a place that's got a lot of restaurants and then we never have to go outside. What's also great is that they have these wonderful events here at the Gaylord at around, you know, Thanksgiving. It usually starts like right before Thanksgiving and then carries through to about January 1st. And this year they have ice, which we're going to go to, which is a Christmas story theme, about nine degrees in there. So we'll show you that. Uh, but they have everything here. They just have tons of restaurants. They have one of the best sports bars I've ever been to. Um, cinnamon bonds, you know, just all these different restaurants, but we'll go take a look. You can expect big crowds and lots of locals. Many families come into the Gaylord from all over the region. You will see license plates from Colorado to Wyoming to Kansas to Texas. When we were there, the Grand Lodge was being renovated, which was very disappointing because it is one of our favorite reasons for coming to the Gaylord. Let us show you the Grand Lodge from other visits to the Gaylord. See what I mean? Wonderful and gorgeous. So we have two double beds. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping they were queens. And no, we don't have a view of the mountains. So, oh well. Oh, we have a nice closet with a safe in here a little uh wet bar actually it's not a wet bar wet bar means there's a sink um little refrigerator some coffee Carrick. let's take a look at this bathroom so, it's nice very nice well, I am wearing... So yeah, our view is not great. At the other the side, awesome. the other side is um, beautiful view of the mountains, but it's snowing, so you can't see them anyways. <laughs> but we're looking towards uh, Denver Airport, which is east. Here's the lobby area. The Starbucks. This is their marketplace. They have different restaurants. There's like a looks like Mexican. <laughs> Well, I didn't Trading post. It's very busy right now because of all the events that are going on. 
So they also have like a circus soule thing going on for Christmas. So everything's over at the convention center, which we're walking over to. So everybody's here is all dressed warm because it's nine degrees inside of ice. Mm -hmm. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. On the second day of Christmas, my true love gave to me two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. On the third day of Christmas, my true love gave to me three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the fourth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me Four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the fifth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me five golden rings. Four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. All sorts of workshops going on, making gingerbread men making all sorts of things that you can sign up for. Where's the pool on the left for adults? Oh, fantastic. Actually, I have a bunch of outdoor hot tubs. Yeah, this is probably so. I just that it's not. So they obviously have a heated pool because <laughs> everybody's swimming and it's like 19 degrees out right now because it just snowed. So during the summer, this is probably really nice. But I mean, it's seriously cold out right now and it just kind of cracks me up. Just walking out here in a bane suit, no thank you. I mean, you can see all the snow on the lounge chairs. <laughs> But yet, there's a bunch of people in the pool. <laughs> I have a snack bar. 